one of the questions that I get asked fairly frequently is are carnivorous plants do they make good fly repellents and if so which one's the best uh, <laughs> it's kind of ironic really because a repellent is something that deters insects whereas uh, obviously carnivorous plants are more likely to attract them but I know what people mean they want if they've got a bit of a, a fly problem they want to know if, if these plants will get rid of them um, the answer and it's quite an anticlimax answer is uh, they're not particularly good for dealing with uh, fly problems I don't think anyway um, they do have some uses of obviously with that sort of thing but they're not they're not really uh, the best for it but uh, that being said I mean if you think about it let's think think of the the, the four main types of carnivorous plant venus flytrap sundew pitcher plant and tropical pitcher plant now the trouble with the things like the venus flytrap and the pitcher plant and the tropical pitcher plant is that firstly the odds of flies or of insects visiting them isn't particularly high secondly uh, what are the chances if they do get visited of the insects actually going into the trap traps and thirdly if they do get into traps, not so much for the Venus fly trap, but for the um, the pitch plants, if they do get into traps, what are the odds of the insects getting out again? For instance, now the reason why I've um, I, I've left the sundew out of this discussion so far is because I think the sundew is probably the best plant for uh, for people that have issues with uh, lots of flies because if a fly lands on a sundew uh, chances are they're screwed you know, whereas the other plants they have to land on a specific part or walk through a specific part or touch a specific trigger, trigger hair but with the sundews because there's tentacles everywhere they just land on one of them bad boys and usually that renders them as being quite screwed but the other, other good reason why uh, the sundew is the best plant for this particular situation is that when you uh, when you if, if you go to walk to grab hold of a fly the fly will fly away obviously because it's, it's, it's scared of you isn't it it'll fly away if you pick up a sundew and put the tentacle towards a fly flies tend to be much more sort of tame when you go towards them with that sort of plant because they don't necessarily see it as an enemy and in some cases I've actually had flies actually fly onto the tentacles when I bring them closer to it which can make it a, a pretty good thing for catching flies and um, I remember a few weeks back we had a problem in the conservatory where we must have had a dozen or, or so uh, I think they're um, midges or some sort of flying things or whatever I don't know they were flying about and I put one of my uh, sundews in there a Drosser, a Dictoma for the, uh, the Latin name there and overnight it managed to catch I think eight of them so it did a pretty good job of that but typically speaking if you have a problem with flies uh, carnivorous plants are not really the way to go because they don't they don't feed as, as much as people think they do if I got a, my biggest Venus fly trap put it in the middle of the garden and left it for a couple of days chances are it probably wouldn't catch anything so uh you know they don't they don't catch flies with as much regularity as, as people think they do but um but yeah if you do have a problem with flies in in the house or whatever if there's one plant you should you should get to try and combat it at least i would recommend a sundew uh like i say joshua dictoma is very good dictoma however it's pronounced if not just a regular uh, Joshua Capensis, which is basically the average Sunday you get at your uh, your local garden centre. So uh, yeah, just to sum it all up, plants aren't the kind of plants aren't the best to, for uh, for fly repellents, but sundews are pretty decent at getting them, and I recommend one if you wanted to use a plant to uh, bring an end or help bring an end towards your fly pest problem.